Our person of the week, a name that was virtually unknown to most people even a week ago. Now Jeremy Lin is trending everywhere. The most searched headline and name on the internet as we came on the air tonight. And look at this paper here in New York today. May the best man Lin. Tonight, he's our person of the week. The headlines, too many to count. Lin your face, the mighty Lin. His towel is mighty good. Still sleeping on his brother's couch in New York, no home of his own. Jeremy Lin and his parents could not have imagined this. Five, Jeremy Lin. Up the crowd. Nor could his fans now all over this country who've been stunned by his sudden stardom. A fast break for this point guard who for a long time looked like he was going nowhere fast. Cut from two NBA teams, he went undrafted after graduating from Harvard, a degree in economics. The odds of a turnaround like this, any econ major could tell you, slim to none. Continues to but suddenly he's been credited with winning not one game, but the last three games for the Knicks. 25 points, then scoring 28 points in the next game, then 23 points. But to really appreciate this, you need to hear his backstory. The first American-born player of Chinese descent in the NBA. His parents both 5'7". He's well over six feet. Raised in California, his father reportedly telling him as a kid, do your homework after dinner, and then by 8.30 we can take you to the YMCA. But it was always a long shot. But all of that practice suddenly paying off, dazzling packed arenas and inspiring new songs. Uh, this is what can happen when you dream of Jeremy Lin. His legion of fans calling this Lin Sanity. His reaction? I didn't know that you could turn Lin into so many things. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be able to establish myself in the rotation. That's what I felt like I could do. But, you know, the reality of the situation was I was a 12th to 15th guy uh, on the team. His popularity reaching global heights. Not since Yao Ming played in the NBA has there been such excitement overseas in China and Taiwan. After several injuries plagued the Knicks, Jeremy got his start putting up numbers in his first games, rivaling the likes of Michael Jordan and Kobe Bryant, who, by the way, he plays tonight. Big company, born from big dreams. I love basketball, I think, ever since I was uh, young. That's all I really wanted to do. I just wanted to play as long as I could. Jeremy Lin does it again! And so we choose Jeremy Lin, who, by the way, didn't even have a guaranteed contract until this week.